Here we go. New Omniframe. So a few words from the Nami Starfarer. Is it co is it pronounced correctly? Is it Starfarer? But she's a fire tank. She's the new meta. She replaces Nanami Pulse, basically, because she's just better. She even has time stop. And that's another thing that's coming in this patch. Time stop. This will change everything. Liv Imperia will have time stop, right? Selena Capriccio and she and, and her. So that alone makes her better. It's basically free damage because the time gets stopped. But it's called lag calculation in this game. Oh, and characters you can support with her would be Lee Palefire. He's basically the budget fire DPS. Karenina Amber, hyper real in the future. As a support, you can use Sophia. Or Liv Imperia could also be a sub DPS for now. Or, or temporary DPS if you wait for hyper real. Did I forget anyone? Oh god. This is another highlight. <laughs> This skin is absolutely, absolutely amazing. Jesus, this is like the true equivalent we got recently with the spending event. This looks so freaking dope. And the Kamui skin. Would you say, would you say that this skin, oh my god. Goodness, this picture, man. I want this as a background, <laughs> but without the, the text. Um, would you say the skin is better than the other Veritas skins? I would almost say even the black one. She looks like a knight in that, but this is just super cool. Jesus. Before we continue here, um, so you can get this for free with those fortunes. This is like, a, isn't this a currency from an event in the new patch? And this costs half of the fortunes. Oh, and if they don't mention it, we will get a free S rank selector in this new patch. Can't wait. My Rosetta is coming home. Oh. So this should be for free because this coding also looks dope. Reminds me a bit of Bioshock, man. <laughs> like, not so much the other mech, but this mech looks so Bioshock-like. Then she must be the the little girl with the with the needle, huh? Then we get her CUB. Can we quickly check out what the CUB has as skills? Um, we'll rush towards the enemy's vicinity, pulling in enemies within range and performing a spinning attack to deal damage. Also, oh, it has crowd control, huh? Nanami's pet is a crowd controller. Then a new dorm or what? Then a new scene for the story and other battles, new areas, new content guild expedition, properly assigned members to attack nodes. Oh, this is also coming to obtain stamps and Ruppen resonance shards. Oh, that's dope. Okay, that's also a highlight in this patch. I didn't even have this on the radar. Okay, I'm not 100% sure what this is. Maybe we see a quick preview. No, we don't. Okay, currently no idea what this exactly is. We will see. Cat grab. Oh no, okay. I think Genshin Impact had this once as a, as a WAP event. Quite a lot of mini games, huh? 
a content pack patch. But yeah, they didn't they didn't mention this S rank selector we get, and the time stop gets added, which is one of the biggest implementations after this <laughs> from previous patch, where transcendence and uh, uniframes and omniframes can be used in the same team. And Liv Imperia and Selena Capriccio get some quality of life fixes. Not sure what exactly this is, but guys, who do you pick in the S rank selector? For me, it's for sure already. It's it's for certain I pick Rosetta. There's no other unit I want. Although since I got Plume, another time on the banner. What's SSS Plume, by the way? 